everyone, this is Marman641 here, and welcome to another Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild video. Today, uh, we're going to be playing uh, the, pa the second DLC pack. It's called The Champion's Ballad. A new challenge related to the champions has been added. Once you have completed the main quest for all four Divine Beasts, return to the Shrine of Resurrection, and inspect the terminal where you first found the Sheikah Slate. Oh yeah, that's, that's it. That's just it. That's what it all says. Alright, well let's go ahead and just not waste some more time. Let's see, is this regular mode? It is regular mode. Alright, let's continue the game. And let's have some fun! Uh, Alright, I'm also testing out this new set of headsets. This is brand new, by the way. Um, how do they sound? How do they work? Are they perfect? Are they not perfect? Uh, let me know in the chat, and if something's wrong, I'll quickly go change it. Link. Zelda. Link. I have witnessed your journey. You have overcome every challenge laid before you. Ruta, Rudania, Meadow, Naboris. All of the divine beasts are now free. With the strength you have attained, I am certain you can unlock the powerful force hidden within. Go to the Shrine of Resurrection and return the Sheikah Slate to its terminal. Alright. Alright, so we're gonna go to the Shrine of Resurrection. We also have the Asian Horse Rumors. We also have some of all these side quests that are opening up, because we got the DLC added into our disposal. And, uh, yeah. Alright, so we're going to the Shrine of Resurrection and see what we got this time. Oh, we got a follower. Hold on, I'm gonna have to, uh, we got a follower. Uh, first and foremost, I need to let the stream delay catch up because I have no idea. Because the alerts are not on my screen. Snowy Midnight. Snowy Midnight, thank you so much for the follow. Alright, so. There's the Shrine of Resurrection. As you see, there's a Korok here. Because I went back to go get a, uh... We, go, we went back to go get a, a Korok seed once. And, uh, yeah, that's where he is. But now let's go ahead and place the Sheikah Slate on this terminal. And let's see what content we get. Sheikah Slate of the Champion's Verication is complete. Activated the Divine Beast Terminal Trial. Tamer's Trial. Associate locations have been marked on the map. Okay, so now there's four different locations on the Great Plateau right now that we have to go visit. Well, looks like we're going back to the very beginning of the game because we are... Oh. What's this? By the way, this is completely blind, by the way. Uh, take hold of a provided weapon to begin the trial. Ah, crap. I gotta, just, I gotta get rid of something. Uh, let's see, what do I want to get rid of? What's the least impressive weapon I don't want to keep? This is rod, I guess. I'll get rid of the rod. Hello there, Snowy Midnight. Oh god! It's taking all my health! What are you doing? Ah. 
I am Maz Koshia. I am now addressed the one witches of the Master of Divine Beast. To undertake this task requires unwearying dedication. The weapon defeats foes with one hit. However, it reverses it also true as it wields as fallen whatever it says. You can also use the weapon's ability only twice the said period of time, only when it's glowing. When enough time passes, the weapon will regain its scene along with its power. At, all, at the four marked locations of, with Great Plateau, defeat all monsters present to prove your power. I'm doing good, Midnight. If you're not up to this challenge, leave this plateau. This weapon will be whatever it says. I can't read that fast. We got the one hit obliterator, a weapon that defeats foes with one hit and causes the user to die in one from one hit. It loses its sheen and power after two constant constitutes uses, but will eventually regain both. Okay. Alright, so we are currently with one hit damage. And uh, we have the one hit kill weapon in our disposal, which is awesome. And by the way, I'm wearing the Xenoblade uh, Chronicles armor, but I'm going to change my armor status, actually, to the, to the classic Link clothes. Alright. Okay, so I guess I have to do all this in one hit. That may be a challenge. Okay, let me go ahead and disable all my other marks that I have set. No, I want to disable all of them. Let's see, where is... Okay, I think I got all the pens I needed. But though, it doesn't matter, because I can also fly over there. Alright, as you can see, the whole place is all covered with fog. So, we gotta get around it safely. Let's go to the first one, which is over here. One hit kill. Like that. We got the Fernic Bow. Oh crap. I gotta disable I gotta get rid of my weapons. You know what? Let's see. I'm gonna get rid of three of each of if each one. Let's see. What do I wanna get rid of? I guess I'll get rid of this. So what I came here for? Alright, so what am I supposed to do here? Am I supposed to kill every enemy in the area, or what? I have no- I know nothing about this. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to kill every enemy? Am I supposed to go and find a certain thing? What am I looking for? I got all the items, yeah, but... Wait, where's the keys? There's the keys. God, I, I hear bees.
does not kill people in one hit. I gotta let it recharge. Alright, so it recharges over time at least. Since I've played it, I beat all the enemies. Alright, so you have to kill every enemy, I'm guessing, in a certain area. Oh, yeah, that's exactly what I do. And then a shrine opens up. Alright, I probably didn't see that earlier. Alright, and a shrine opens up. Awesome. So, we got another challenge. Oh, wait, where is it? Here, let me quickly save since I... And I'm assuming, does it all have to be done in one hit, or can you refill your HP? Okay, well, there's the shrine. The Yawaki Ita Shrine. So I have to beat this whole thing in one hit. If I use food to eat, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen if I eat? Is the is the thing on my back gonna shred me back down? That would suck. By the way, uh, so snowy midnight. So you've beaten this DLC before. Well, let me quickly do this before you say anything else. Uh, do not spoil. Do not spoil the game. Only help me if I'm stuck, please. That will probably be the best option of assistance. You who seek foot in the shrine, Yoka Ata Shrine, in the name of the goddess of Hylia, I offer a trial. Collect, collected soul. Alright. Alright. Alright, I guess this requires a lot of... ...stuff. Okay. I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna get hit. Okay, thank goodness. Alright. I'm gonna need Magnesis. I have to collect it with this bowl. Man, it's gonna be hard to collect things. I need to catch that chest, that's what I want to do. Got the chest, reel it to end, don't drop it, thank goodness. Bomb arrows, nice. Alright. You can get the big one or the small one, whatever it works. Gotta carefully bring it to me without dropping it. Oh god, that is so close. Careful, 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 careful. Okay. Do I put it in here? I do. Okay, so how do I drop it in here? How do I drop it? Ok, 
Okay, I do that, and then I run over here, and then push it in. There we go. Nice. And we got another Ferric bow. Okay, I gotta empty out all my equipment. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna quickly empty out everything I have. Just to do this trial. I can equip a shield, can I? I hope so. I can, but I can't equip any swords. Because it's illegal. Look at all of these weaponry that I dropped. There's a little ladder down here. There's something down here. What's it for? Do I want to go down there, or is this going to waste my time? I have no idea. Alright. Ah. Okay, I need to get this small orb if I can. Okay, got that. Lift it up. No, don't drop it. Careful. Oh shoot, oh god, thank goodness, Christ. And I can pick this up. Oh, carefully. Link, get up there. Thank you. Pick up. And I see what I need to do. I need to do this without getting hit too much. That ladder is going to waste time. Yeah, you're right. Thank you. Thank you for telling me that. Alright, I gotta get through this safely. Here, I'm going to quickly save. Although, it's probably not going to matter. Dear Lord. Okay, thank goodness. Made that. And we are done. I think... What, what's going on here is I'm going to get four spirit orbs so I can get myself in final extra heart container. Well, I'm still missing three hearts. I got every single orb in the game, and all what's left is three heart containers that I need to fill up. That's all what's left. Your resourceful is overcoming. This trial speaks of the promise of a hero. In the name of Goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Alright, so I might actually get an extra heart container at the end of this. Because I need four spirit orbs in order to actually get an extra piece of energy. May the goddesses smile upon you. Okay, so just as the same exact dialogue as every other shrine. Eh, yeah, whatever. It's okay. No big deal. Alright, let me quickly save the progress so I don't lose it. Alright, so... Let's see, uh, the next closest location... I think we'll go to the Icy Alps last. But for right now, let's just go over here. Which I believe is this way, isn't it? No, it's this way. It is. We go that way. That way! Let's go! I can still pick up weapons along the way, can I? Although, the only weapons I can use is the bow and arrow and the shield. Although I have a Hylian shield, so that could also be a boost. I can't use my Master Sword, though. That bird better not attack me.
There's the market town, the castle market town. Which was something supposed to be like the, uh, the market from the original game of Ocarina of Time that was been set to ruin. At least you don't see enemies till- WHOA! What am I being fired at? Who's firing at me? What was going on? What, what exploded that made me burst into flames? What happened? Alright, I'm gonna take the normal route. Where I just go down... Oh! There is a fire choo-choo over there. I still have my arrows. Even though I'm not supposed to have them. Whatever. Yeah, there is, like, fire choo-choo over here. Wow, they make a big explosion. Wow. That's crazy. Okay. I see what's going on. That guy dropped the ball on me. Well, you know what? Die. You're not gonna do the same mistake. Eh, uh, nah, I'm not gonna drop the ball. Unless it drops on its own, gosh darn it. situation right now and these guys are keeping their distance I don't see them coming very well okay uh, let's see here I need bombers Ah! Watch out for this guy! You don't see me at all, you die. Okay, gotta stick around. You're a really one sneaky little fellow, aren't you? You are one. Rep Uh... <laughs> 
Dear Lord and Savior, save me now. Save us all. Did this game autosave? Because I am not going through this whole entire thing again. Please tell me it autosaved somewhere. I'm getting a bit paranoid right now. Watch out! Ah! Watch out! It's gonna explode! Oh god, that was so close. Okay, kill you, then run. Then kill you. Oh, and we're done. Be careful around those enemies. It hurts me a lot. It does hurt people a lot, because you only get one hit. But yeah. Alright. Anyways, I have to basically do four of these other DLC shrines, and that will give me an access to a heart piece or somewhat at the end of this, because I can turn in all of my things in. Where is the thing spawning at? Where did it spawn? It spawned over here. Oh, let me get this meat. Although it's not going to help at all since I can't really use it to heal myself. Let me get this meat. Even though it's not going to help, because... You know what? Here, let me save. I'm really curious. What happens if I actually do eat? I'm curious. I'll always load. That thing will just send me backwards. Okay, well, I'm gonna load so that way I don't lose my meat, and I'll save it once I am done with my weapon. Shrine nearby. It's right over here. Oh god, bees, bees, bees! Zubbas or rabber. Or Zubbas rabber. Barota Kashi Shrine. Alright, stop to start. Okay, I see what's going on. I need to use stasis. So what is this about? It's gonna launch in the air? I'm confused. Okay. Oh, why did I do that? I may be a little bit confused about this, but I'm gonna try to figure this around. What? 
Why would you spawn me outside of the at the Why would you spawn me outside of the shrine? It doesn't save when you're in the shrine. That's stupid. Why would you spawn me outside of the shrine? Usually when you enter a shrine, it saves. That's what you, what usually happens. You don't get thrown out of a shrine if you lose. What kind of torture is this? I can use this again. Alright, well here's the second room. This league seems to be a bit more dangerous than the first one. We have gears. With spikes. A lot of thinking. That's what's going on here. If I can climb it... I can. It just wasn't agreeing with me. The Forest Dweller's Shield. Uh, nah, I'm not gonna use any of these shields. This is already tough. Ugh, gosh, barely made that. Oh. My. No. You cannot be serious. Okay, made that. Guess you gotta pause at everything. Dear Lord. What the heck? What the heck is this obstacle course? I think the best way to do this is to stace the second second thing. Oh what the hell? I did not press the attack button in mid-air. That's bullshit. Here, I'll go for the second one. There we go. That works safely. Alright, made that. And now I'm back here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I gotta let it recharge first. Let it recharge first. Alright. Jesus. Kind of 
jump on that. Make that. And we're finally done. Oh man. Man, for a second trial is not it's really difficult for a second trial. Alright, but we got it. Don't worry about it, guys. We got this. Alright, only two more to go. Two more to go. Cass! What are you doing here? Hmm. How it's unexpected to see a traveler on the solitary plateau. Ah, we meet again. Hmm. Not to be rude, but you don't look so well. Much like this plateau, you're looking a mite dearly. Oh, I apologize. Perhaps I it was not my place to say as much, I understand, more than most of the burden of travel. As for me, I came to this spot to pursue an ancient song at a hero of this very plateau. Oh. I can't shake the feeling that we were destined to meet here. In any case, would you like to hear my song? Uh, yes, please. Oh. Thank you, kind traveler. Evan. The flames crawl, the water rise. The lightning strikes, the wind sighs. A beast beyond the divine four. Awaits a hero. Forever, forevermore. Let not the sound. Leave horses rilled. Breathe in the breathe. Of the wild. Mm. Curious indeed, as it were, I pers were uh, I perused my teacher old notes and found that song there. Hmm. Mm -hmm. What sort of sound could al alarm a horse so effectively? Kabam, kapow, rumble, rumble. Honestly, I haven't had a clue. It certainly helps to visit the locations that inspire its song, and yes, it helps an open mind of to exploration. Both notes had ne had other interesting songs too, and I plan to visit those locations as well. We'll probably do that whenever we get to it. Maybe we'll meet Cass again. I'm not sure. All right, uh, let's go this way. I like that song. Okay, probably nothing. Well, here it is, over here. I know that in the master, master, uh, master mode, there was a rhino here. I believe you're gonna bring that rhino back, but I'm not sure. If so, then gosh darn it. Oh!
Watch out! Whoa, I'm getting input lag. these guys Ah stab me in the heart What's the last save point? Oh god. Even the weakest weapon like the leaf could kill you. You can kill enemies in one hit. The punishment is, you die in one hit. And every time when I respawn, I'm facing the wrong direction. Every time I respawn, I'm facing the wrong direction. Here, let me save here. I'm gonna kill this asshole. Get out of there! Jesus. Here, save. Save quickly before I lose progress. Because I'm not doing what I just did again. I just need to kill this enemy. And then I think I'm done, maybe. Maybe. There's probably another enemy. Yeah, there's another one enemy. Yes, there is. It's over here. And we're done with this one. Probably should just try to calm down a bit. The Ruvo Korba Shrine.
Oh, it's a test of strength. Well, I can easily kill this test of strength in one hit. Well, it also depends on what the enemy is. I can kill this guy in one hit. I think. Unless they disable it, which would suck. Yeah, see? One hit. There's not that much of a challenge because I got the one hit kill weapon. It's not much of a big challenge because I got the one hit kill weapon. So like, okay, there has to be more than what it is. Oh, yep, there has to be more. I know, I just know that there's more. Someone tells me I'm gonna need them. It's gonna spawn another enemy. It's gonna spawn another enemy, so we gotta face another one. Unfortunately. Are we brave enough? I hope so. Or not, we'll just go down. We have an entirely new section. But you can kill him in one hit, doesn't matter. You can still kill him in one hit. I highly recommend just take your shield out and then just focus really carefully. We need to get a key, and I'm guessing it's up there. And in order to do that, we're gonna have to circle around. And because there's water everywhere, I'm gonna assume we're gonna need cryonics. Kill one hit. At least with a weapon, this 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 temple isn't much of a big issue. If you do get hit by some miracle, then you gotta do this all over again. And obviously, you don't want that. So we're going to have to use cryonics here. Maybe we'll get a reward. Maybe. Or not, because all we'll just do is just... You know, we can swim. We can always swim. But it will just lead to nothing, because there's nothing underneath here. So, I'm assuming that this is there for no reason. <laughs> but you know, I realized something. Something's attacking me? Oh. I don't need to go up there, but... Let's go up there. And here is probably a key. It is. But before I do so, there's this little bit of an alcove over here that I can also go to. That led me to this box. A giant ancient core. Nice.
Yeah, you know what? Now I don't need the stairs. I can use this. I don't need the stairs. I can do this. But we have one more challenge, I'm guessing. Dear Lord. Ow! I was not prepared for this. I was not prepared for this. Okay, well, we're going to have to do this again. Probably from the very beginning. But hey, at least I still have the key, so I don't have to do the entire thing again. Do I have to fight that boss again? Nah, I don't need to. At least I still have the key, so I don't have to worry about long ones. Alright, so I have my bomb arrows, right? I do, so. Get out of there. Gotta run. Run! They can't get me through here, can they? No, they can't. Thank goodness. Take you out. And... Take you out. There we go! That's how it's done, baby. That is how it's done. And that is how it's done, guys. Then you climb to the top here, and then reclaim your orb. Awesome. We are done with this third shrine. Alright, we got one more, uh, we have one more shrine to go to. If you're telling me I need to wear some freezing clothes, well actually I do have some freezing clothes, so I think they're gonna want me to. I think they're gonna want me to put on some warm clothes. And I could potentially warp, but do I want to? That could ruin the game. But yeah, it's gonna be cold, so I'm gonna have to put on some warm clothes. Got to put on some warm clothes. Be sure these keys don't kill me. I have a feeling it's a trap. Okay, well it's not really a trap, but... You can never be too sure. Alright, 
Let's go and save. Yeah, it takes off a lot of these enemies. Oh god. Sure that bowler isn't too stupid to run into me. What the fuck? I can't even see what I'm being attacked by. Okay, what, why am I- I thought I was still- I thought I was not on the pause screen. I am, am still on the pause screen. I was just looking at the chat for a brief moment. Here, can I throw a weapon? No, I can't throw a weapon. I thought I killed you. I guess I saved too early. Okay, wait for him to despawn. There we go. Now save. Do I have another type of arrow besides what I have? I have a lightning arrow. I hate my life. I thought I was sneaky, but I guess I'm not too sneaky. Like, I wanna aim at that icy one, so... This is why my life sucks, guys, because enemies bombard you everywhere and you can't do anything about it. So, you basically gotta think of how you approach it. Because one wrong move can get you in trouble. Here, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna climb this mountain. Maybe I can get a much better vantage point from up here. I missed here. I'm not wasting ammo. I'm gonna catch you up. Fuck you. Kill you.
That's why I gotta save here. Gotta approach this guy with a vengeance. Oh, come on. Never jump on a choo-choo. You'll die. Never jump on a choo-choo. You'll die. Lesson learned by Marty Man 64 one Get to my terrors. They're not running away from me. There. We're done with that one. And last, we got one more shrine opened up on the Great Plateau. We're officially about to be done. After we complete the shrine, we are done. Alright, let's complete this last shrine. East to Kama Shrine. dark. This could mean anything right now. It's a completely dark shrine. The path of light. Hey, well, let's say there's a lot of lasers here. I guess you want me to jump over it? No, I can't jump over it. Not very well, at least. So am I supposed to do something to it? Like, pause the lasers or somewhat? Can I go underneath the lasers? I can. I can go underneath the lasers. When it gets to this laser, though... Go at the right time. There we go. And now it gets more spike gear. I can't 
can't use my weapons. And I'm sure that there is some, like, abysses that you can fall into if you're not careful. I walk too close to the spikes, gosh darn it. And then it gets to this room where you gotta be extra patient because, well, I mean, like, I think there's, I think there's black holes. I want to believe that there's holes. Uh, I guess there's not, but you wouldn't be too sure. Because this room's so dark. There may be some pitfalls. So you can't always be sure. Okay, these are timing ones. Bam, 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 run that. Make that just fine. But then I can't see this very well. Oh, come on! Like, I can't even see them coming. How am I supposed to, how am I supposed to see them coming? And also, it's really hard to approach them because they're also running away from you. Because they know you're an attentional threat. <laughs> he just went for my shield. It just went for my shield. I can't because I because it's so easy to press this button and it's so easy to press this button that you'll crouch. Everyone has this problem with crouching. Who who maps the crouch button to the move button? It's not it's not cool. I wouldn't push like I wouldn't use the crouch button for this button. I would use the crouch button for the other one. But then again, I also have the same exact problem with the camera. So like map them in a different button. I think you can. I just didn't want to. I have no idea. Some dark challenge, you say, huh? I'll show you a dark challenge. Hey, not. I'm gonna use this one. It's pretty much much easier to use. There we go. We're done. No need to deal with that crap anymore. But I know that there's more. Oh, let me guess. A boulder's gonna come from above and it's gonna run into me. Or no, that's just at the A trial. Oh, we're done. We are officially done. Yay, we are finally done with the four trials. I wonder what the game's gonna send me next. We beat the four trials of the Great Plateau. Let's see what this game's gonna send me next. Our Vorful is overcoming. This trial speaks of promise of a hero. In the name, Goddess of Hylia, I bestow you upon this spirit orb.
May God smile upon you. Alright. One hour and 45 minutes into the stream, and we finished before, uh, we finished before Shrines and the Great Plateau. Let's see what the game's gonna send me next. I am Maz Koshi. You have done well to conquer the trials laid before you. You are Hyrule's beacon of hope. But your trials have only just begun. The divine weapons shall lead you. So now the Divine Beasts are going to add some little enhancements. Or in other words, they're just going to have their own challenge. <laughs> Things are happening guys. Things are really happening. I think the Great Plateau is what I like to call part one. Maybe. I'm not sure. Now that you have proven your power, a new journey awaits. Go to the four locations that will be revealed to you and reach for the greater heights than before. Alright, so we're going to the four locations. And we're back into full health. Before I do so, let's go to the Temple of Time. Since we're going to go to the Temple of Time. Since we actually did have four spirit orbs, we can finally get a heart container. For a long time, we are ready to get our heart container back. Because so far, the maximum in this game, you can only fill up your stamina so far. They can only... or, or, it, or health so far. They'll be left out three units of each. But, we can finally even that score. And also, apparently, the, uh, the Temple of Time is over here. I'm an idiot. Where was I going? Alright, to the Temple of Time! by one. Alright. Alright, 
Uh, I think what I'll go is I'll probably do them. Oh, look at that. We get five extra memory fragments for this DLC pack. We're probably going to have to recover these memories. I think what I'll do is I'll go for the trials in the correct order of where I receive the regular memories. So, Revali's first. I'll go to Divine Beast. 